early voting may be over in Sarasota and Manatee counties, but local churches are spending the days in between pushing their congregations to get to the polls. Tuesday, uh, polls on Tuesday. ABC's Kate Flexter has the story. Here at Light of the World Church, the pastor had a really interesting message this morning. It was a call to action. On Sunday, the sermon had a clear message. Get out and vote. For churchgoer Vicki Oldham, it's important. It started out the sermon um, definitely pointing out the importance of uh, voting no matter who wins. Pastor Kelvin Lumpkin delivered the sermon and says it's crucial for churches to be involved in the process. Well, the African American church still holds a special place in the community. Pastors still have a large influence. And um, I don't think I should use my influence to tell people how to vote. But I do think I should use my influence to tell people that you ought to vote. Right now, black voters only account for about 15% of early votes, as opposed to 2012 when they made up about 25% of those votes. That's according to a University of Florida political analyst. Pastor Lumpkin says he's seen some of that apathy firsthand. But I'm mostly concerned about those who just feel like their vote doesn't count and just kind of sit on the sidelines and let it play out. And I think that's a dangerous mentality. Sarasota's NAACP President Trevor Harvey says African-American churches across the country have a history of influencing voter turnout. It's churches' ways to be able to be a part of the process, not telling you who to go and vote down the ticket for, but we're going to encourage our parishioners, hey, let's go vote. Harvey says it's particularly important for the African American community to exercise that right. It's really not who you go out and vote for, it's just that you do go out and vote because our forefathers, many died, uh, you know, blood, sweat, and tears for us to have the right um, to vote. For Oldham, that's what drives her to the polls each year. That's what pushes me to not only vote for myself, but get all of my family members to the poll, every last one of them who are of age. Pastor Lumpkin did say, though, that many are waiting until Election Day to cast their vote. In Sarasota, Kate Flexter, ABC7, your Suncoast News.